Hi everyone, hope you're having a great Friday. Um, I'm going to do another split the duck um, video. This one's gonna be on these Alice in Wonderland Oracle cards. They are adorable. So as I shuffle the cards, just think about your situation. And hopefully when I split the deck, the two cards can give you some clarification on whatever it is that's on your mind. This could be stuff at work. It could be stuff in your relationship. Could be the stuff that's just in your head. Okay, we're gonna split the deck. A moment's regret, nostalgia, idealizing the past, fearing you've made a mistake. And that's number 16. And such a curious dream, grounding, returning to reality, and coming home. So I wonder if somebody out there is thinking too much about the past and maybe romanticizing the past. It may be time to come back to earth, come back to reality. See things from a more grounded perspective. Okay, let's keep going. We're going to split the deck. Okay, we got law is not justice. Rules that are not fair. Number 30. And here we have keeping up. Immense effort. Advance. Oh, that's number 40. You may be putting your, your effort into something that isn't giving you any energy back. It may feel like it's not fair. It's out of balance. You know, her scale is balanced. That might be what she wants. And you might just be running yourself ragged. Just trying to, to get ahead. Putting in too much effort. Maybe not getting enough back. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, we're gonna split the deck. All right, we got nature communication, flower energies, fairy energies, elemental messengers. And over here we have investigate, look closely, ask questions, and think before acting. This may be trying to tell you that you, you need to take a step back and you need to think about what's going on, whatever situation you're thinking about. And it may be telling you that you need to go back into nature. Nature is a great way to get in touch with your higher self and your intuition and that can really help you figure out this problem here let's keep going
Let's split the deck. Who in the world are you? Getting to know the new you. Number 19. I want to be a queen. Stating your sovereignty, declaring freedom, passing a test. Very interesting. Somebody may be transforming, transforming into a higher version of themselves, a newer, higher version of themselves. This is a number 33 card, so you may be seeing um, 33s. Let's keep going. split the deck. Follow your own good advice. Trust yourself. You know what is best for you. A moment's regret, nostalgia, idealizing the past, fearing you've made a mistake. Second time we've gotten this card. So I'm guessing that if you had a friend who was always thinking about the past, you might give them some good advice like, it's time to move forward. Okay, let's keep going. I think we have time for a couple more. Split the deck. Forget who you are. Conditioning falls away. Memory no longer defines you. And do not drink poison. Do not do the things you know are bad for you. So we got number 41 and number 8. So you may be doing a lot of things because you were conditioned to do that. And this is saying... Forget about that. Rewrite your own script. Let's keep going. Okay, we're going to split the deck. All in the golden afternoon. Inspiration, creative spark, imagination, and conception. And that's the number one card. And then we've got all must have prizes. Trying to please everyone. Number 13. What does that mean for you? Maybe time to think about yourself, go within, create new areas of your life instead of always pleasing other people. There might be a bright new path for you. I feel, I feel like I need to do another one. Okay, Spirit will do one more. We're going to split the deck. Last one. Impossible things. Working through disbelief. Imaginative leaps. Fresh perspective. That's number 34. We have this one. Find the lesson. Discover the purpose in a situation. 
trust that you are learning. Number 29. Number 29, 2 plus 9 equals 11. Um, so take that as you will. You may be seeing 11, 11. Uh, that, I think that happens to a lot of people who are near the path, the purpose that they're supposed to be going towards. And um, they might not they might not be taking the steps that they need to. Um, so if you need to find the lesson on the path you're currently on and then move past it, even if it feels impossible, um, work through that. Look at things, fresh perspective. Okay, I hope this helps. Light and love. Have a great day.